This week's message is uh, coming from Muirfield Village Golf Club in Dublin, Ohio. Uh, it is hosting the Memorial Tournament, uh, which is a PGA Tour event. Uh, I'm standing uh, here in one of the uh, skyboxes. Actually, it was a newly developed one uh, just this year, and the green behind me is the 14th. This is my 39th consecutive uh, tournament. And it's kind of interesting. It occurs uh, basically the same time of the year, uh, except for maybe one or two times. It's always toward the end of the May, 1st of June. And in that snapshot that I've been here, the changes I've seen and, and are amazing. And one of the things that I have noticed is that uh, uh, every year that I thought, wow, I can't get better than this, or, or, you know, how can you do better than what's going on right now, is you always can. There doesn't seem to be a ceiling uh, in the world of golf on what you can achieve, whether it's agronomic, management-wise, tournament hosting, whatever. So I think that's something to keep in mind that even though a lot of things seem routine, quote unquote, the management of turf, things continue to improve and increase. So you got to continue to uh, to grow as a person and learn as much as you can. As I mentioned, uh, uh, this is my 39th uh, uh, Memorial Tournament. Actually, my first year I came here was 1984, not to, not to age me. But uh, this tournament actually started in 1976, so I've seen quite a few of them. And looking at the PGA Tour, I went down and uh, uh, looked at tournaments which have been hosted at the same club since their inception. And there's only five tournaments, which uh, I've listed here below. Uh, probably the most famous is the Masters, but it's kind of a unique club to be part of, in this case, the Memorial Tournament. The second thing is, it does give you the ability, or in my case, the ability to see improvements and changes in a snapshot form at the same place over time. And uh, those changes have been, have been amazing. Here at uh, uh, Muirfield, there's been, since my, uh, time here only four superintendents so most of them have had a long longevity here and the most recent is Chad Mark who's seen a lot of improvement and there's a number of things I could comment on but since I'm standing here in this new structure which is new this year along the 14th hall thought I'd mention one when I first uh, when the term I was first being uh, uh, conducted one of the unique things similar to Augusta National was that you had these viewer mounds or patrons or, or fan uh, mounds and green complexes where you could see um, the golf hole you know or see golfers hitting shots which was a big deal because on the older courses that were hosting tournaments you know they were flat it was hard to see if there were five people if you were five people deep or eight people deep to see what was going on. So that was a big kind of change and unique thing. Well now we've evolved, especially in, in probably the last 15 years into these kind of structures that host fans and patrons and, and corporate sponsors and such. Like this structure behind here on, on 14, this wasn't here. Um, 10 years ago and so uh, so a lot of changes go on every year including including where I'm standing now